Daryl, let's talk about annuities. What are your thoughts on someone putting some of their uh, RIF money into uh, an annuity these days? It may, for certain people, make great sense uh, where they're looking to make sure that the financial needs in their situation are covered off by something that is unshakable and is guaranteed. That's where it really kind of makes sense for people to look at it. Now, I know interest rates are low, and that is a key consideration in deciding how much money you will get per month from your annuity. How much does that weigh against the annuity argument right now? You could look at it, uh, given the long-term rates, that it does weigh against it quite substantially in the current environment. But the other side of it is what we would call the psychological right. aspect. Right. And talk to me about how comfortable it is to have an annuity coming in no matter what the stock markets are doing. Well, and you just described it. You've got this income coming in that's not going to be affected by interest rates, by stock markets, and you know that's solid. It also gives you, if you have that awareness, more discretion with how you choose to invest your other assets. Right. So you're saying if I have an annuity and I know that money is coming in no matter what, I might be able to invest with a little bit more aggressiveness in the stock market, for example. Exactly. So that blend of guarantees and the, and the variability and flexibility of other assets invested. It's a really good combination. You know, it's starting to make sense to me, this annuity thing. Thanks. You bet.